Welcome back to our video series. This is our third video under probability lesson. If you have not watched previous two videos, I advise you to watch those two and come. In this video, I am going to discuss how we are going to draw a grid when replacement without replacement words are given in your question. For that, I have taken a box where we have three red marbles, two blue marbles and one black marble. If we are going to pick two marbles simultaneously, there can be two options. One is, I take the first marble and note the color going to replace it back in the box and randomly I'm going to pick the second marble. Here first marble which was selected was replaced back. That means if I take this only black marble out inside the box now we don't have a black marble but before taking the second marble I'm going to replace it and again going to pick a marble render so before taking the second one I'm going to replace that means for the first take as well as for the second take I have all six marbles so if I want to draw the grid it should give two axes with all six options this is my first take. So my possible outcomes are red 1, red 2 and red 3. I denote these three red marbles as R1, R2, R3. Similarly, here B1, B2, B2 and one and only black marble as BN. This is my second thing. Now I have to complete the entire grid with crosses. This is the completed grid. Now using this grid I am going to answer the following questions. First one they are asking the probability of obtaining two red marbles. That means we have to take two red marbles. First take, it should be either of these three. In second take, anything from these three. So these are the process. We have nine process selected out of 36 answer is 1 thing second one probability of obtaining only one only one blue marble so it can be a blue marble only in first take or a blue marble only in second take so we can't have two blue marbles can be first take blue 1 or blue 2 and we can't have same color blue color for the second take that means we can't have these two if I am referring to first take I must pick the marble from these two but not these two that means I can have this part up to here and these two marbles. This set represent blue marbles for the first take and red marbles for the second take. That means we are obtaining blue only in first take. These two crosses represent blue color for the first take but black color for the second take. 
why we didn't choose this? They represent blue color for the first and blue color for the second as well. Since we had this place only, we can't select these four. Then what is the other option? We can obtain blue color marble in second take, then we can't have blue color for the first day. So we can have this set. Here we have blue color for the second take but not for the first take and these two. So all these enclosed circles, uh, enclosed crosses in red represent blue marbles. Only one. How many are there? Here we have six. Here six altogether. Twelve. And this is four. Sixteen. On top. 36 and we have 4 over 9 third question a red marble in first take so we have to identify red color in first take blue color in second take so first marble it should be red. What are the opportunities? Three red marbles for the first day. That means these three columns. And you have to combine the other condition. Blue marble for the second day. Second day, blue. So with these three columns, you have to coincide these two rows. For the first day, it should be red. For the second day, it should be blue. This is the region. In this region, we have six crosses out of 36. The answer is one over six. Fourth question. Same color twice. So here they are referring only to the color. So we have to select same color. From the first day, if we are taking red color, from the second take also we must have red. So what are the crosses? This box. If we are selecting blue from the first, it should be blue from second as well. So what are the crosses? Blue from here and blue from here that means this one. This box. And one option is available in this corner. If I take first uh, if I take black marble from first day and I can have black from second day as well. So that is also same color. So all together I have this much of process. So can you notice that? Here we have nine marble, twenty marbles. Can you notice it? Here we have 9 crosses and 4, 9 plus 4, 13, 13 plus 1, 14. Answer is 14 over 36. So when I simplify, I get 7 over 18. Before going to the fifth question, let me raise this. Okay. Fifth one we have same marble twice. Here they are referring to the same identical marble, not only the color. So, same marble means the diagonal what we have in this box because this cross represents red one and red one, same marble. Here we have red two with red two. Identical marble. Red 3, red 3. Identical. B1, B2. That means you can notice this diagonal represents the same marble. We have 6 crosses there out of 36. For the last question, probability of obtaining at least 
one red marker. At least, at least red. That means we can have a red marble with blue marker, red marble with a black marker, or two red marbles. At least one means either we can have one red with a different color or two red marbles. For the first take, if I select red, I can take these three columns. We don't want to worry about second take because they are referring to at least. If we are selecting a red marble for the first take, it can be either red or any other color for the second take. So these three columns are taken for our question and if I am taking a different color from the first take, definitely it should be red for the second take. Then only we satisfy this at least one red option. So I can take let me pick red color for this one. I can have these three columns with red for the second take. That is these two colors. These three rows. Or do that we have the 6, 12, 18, 21, 24, 26, 27 over 36. So when I simplify, I get 9 over 12. You can simplify that further, and 9, that is 3 over. Thank you. If in a question they have specially mentioned the first take is not going to be replaced, we have to erase the diagonal, complete the grid, and you have to erase the crosses available in the diagonal. So let us answer these questions according to the grid. Probability of obtaining two red marbles. If I want to obtain two red marbles, my both takes must be red. So here we have six crosses out of 30. Why? These six crosses in the diagonal are missing. So we have only 30 crosses. That is one over five. Second question. Only one blue mark. Only one means we can have a blue marble for the first take or a blue marble for the second take. We can't have blue marbles for both takes. So that is blue here, blue here with a different color for the second take. That means these and we can have these two because these two represent blue color for the first take and black color for the second take and if I remove first take definitely I must pick a blue marble from the second take and it should be not blue from the first so I can't obtain these two crosses region but not including these two it's like a cross we must have this while our first take is red second take is blue so we have only one blue mark this set first take is blue second take is red these two, first take blue, second take black. First take is black, second take is blue. So all together here we have 6, 12, 30, 40, 50, 60.
Simplify, we get 8 over 15. Third question. Probability of obtaining a red marble in first take and a blue marble in second take. So first take, I have to enclose red color. First take, red color. This color. Second take, blue color. These three columns, second take, blue color. These two rows. So what is the region? These six rows. Why? First take is red, second take is blue. We have six rows identified out of their people. One over five. Fourth row. Same color twice. Same color twice. If I take red color from the first take, I must obtain same color, red color from the second take as well. This region. If I select blue color for the first take, I have to obtain blue color for the second take. This region. We have two process. Then first take black, second take black. There is no Cross indicating black and black. So we have only here 6 and 2, 8 crosses. So the answer is 8 over 10. Same marble twice. So since we are not going to replace the first marble, we can't have the same marble twice because when we take a marble out, it is not inside the box where we can find the same marble again. So, we can't have any process satisfying this. Probability is same. Last one, at least one red marble. So, at least one red means for the first take, you can have red and any other color or red and red. At least means either one red or both can be red. So for that, how many crosses are there? These three columns, these three rows. So here we have 18, here we have 15, and 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23. 24 process out of 30. Simplify down to 4 over 5. So, in this video, I have discussed an example where replacement is there and for the second part, without replacement. So, when there is no replacement, diagonal is missing. Hope you understood everything which I have discussed in this lesson. See you in my next video.